WordPress 6.4 is just around the corner. Let's take a closer look at the new features and enhancements coming with the latest update. The WordPress version 6.4 is set for full release on November 7th, 2023. This update includes major improvements by integrating Gutenberg version 16.2 to 16.7 into the WordPress core. The 6.4 release merged fewer Gutenberg versions than the previous updates. However, there were still a lot of improvements made to the blog editor. Let's check out the new features of this update starting with the new default theme. 2024 breaks away from the traditional blog-centric default WordPress themes. Instead, it aims to suit businesses, agencies, and portfolios. This theme is highly versatile as shown by the pattern collection, which introduces categories like portfolio, team, banners, and testimonials. The default homepage now mirrors a business website landing page, showcasing a business description, services offered, and a subscription call to action. You will also appreciate the abundance of placeholder text, making content creation easier than ever. All in all, this theme offers greater flexibility and is a great starting point for new WordPress users. The pattern creation feature from version 6.3 is now enhanced with custom pattern categories. You can now neatly categorize custom patterns beyond the default one and assign them to multiple categories as well. The list view also received updates for a better user experience and organization. You can now rename container blocks like group, stack, and row. To do this, click here and select rename. Grouping content in custom named container blocks such as this will simplify navigating to the desired section in the list view. Moreover, gallery and image blocks now feature thumbnail previews. While this change is more subtle than others, it simplifies the navigation in the list view, especially for image-rich content. When you add a hyperlink to a text, you can set it to be open in a new tab. However, you'll need to open the link editing interface and the advanced settings, which is a hassle for such a simple action. Within the WordPress 6.4 release, an open and new tab toggle is available in the link preview. This way you can change the settings quickly. The newest WordPress release has an improved toolbar for navigation, list, and quote blocks. They now have built-in child blocks by default. The toolbar remains attached to the parent block position when working with the inner content, so that the toolbar won't obstruct the content within these blocks. However, note that this feature is still limited to these three blocks. It won't work on other nested blocks like columns, buttons, and group blocks. The WordPress 6.4 image block includes an aspect ratio tool within its placeholder. You can set the desired aspect ratio before uploading any image, and the placeholder will adjust itself, previewing the occupied image's space. Plus, the image block adds a lightbox feature. This lets users magnify images in an overlay instead of a new tab or loading a new page. To activate it, enable the expand on click toggle in the image block settings. You can add a custom background image for group, stack, and row blocks in WordPress 6.4, enhancing your site's visual design. To add one, open the Styles tab in the Block Settings panel, and you'll find the background section to upload or choose an image from the media library. This feature ensures you're not limited to having content with a background image on the cover block. In addition, the container blocks are more flexible than the cover block regarding content layout, so this feature opens up more design possibilities. The only drawback is that currently, there's no way to adjust the opacity or reposition an image. Therefore, you must ensure an image meets design requirements before uploading it as a background. In older WordPress versions, the native pagination block reloads the page when moving to another page. Since it creates a slower browsing experience for end users, the WordPress core team improves this feature in WordPress 6.4. The query loop pagination will now switch pages without reloading the whole page. Another improvement to the block is the customizable page navigation, which lets you define how many pages you will want to display. Command Palette was a new addition in WordPress 6.3, and new commands have been added to it ever since. In WordPress 6.4, new block-centric commands are accessible when you open the command palette while selecting a block. Some of the new commands are group, ungroup, duplicate, remove, add before, add after, and transform. 
Moreover, the WordPress core team has added some more contextual commands that apply in various places of editors. For example, open list view is in the site editor, exit code editor, hide or show breadcrumbs, enable or disable pre-published checklist, and preview in a tab. And that's all the WordPress 6.4 new features and improvements. What do you think about this new WordPress update? Leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to Hostinger Academy for more videos about WordPress website development and troubleshooting tips. Thank you for watching and good luck on your online journey.